Hi everybody, it's Boaz Faller and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for March, March, April 5th, 2016. The moon is in Pisces today and there's a lot, a lot of things happening in the sky. The moon is in Pisces and it's opposing Jupiter. We have to remember to stay, to stay uh, uh, calculated, uh, to, to stay uh, humble and to really moderate our actions and not go all the way out and come on too strong. There is a square to Saturn at noontime, Central European time. That's around 5 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's a time that we can feel a little less uh, sure about uh, ourselves and our values. It's a time that we are more challenged in our relationships with authoritative figures in our lives. So we have to be uh, wary of that, especially in work environments and uh, acknowledge that there's a sensitivity there today and we need to bypass it in a positive way. There is a sextile to Pluto at around 1300 hours Central European time, that's around 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's a time that we find the strength within us to deal with the challenges in our lives and that's very positive. And then there's a conjunction to Chiron at 2100 hours uh, Central European time. That's 1500 hours Eastern Standard Time. That's a time that we could be in touch with our inner pains and we could heal them. So it's a painful time, but it's also a positive time. The sun is still trining Saturn. It's a good time for progress with everything that's related with your career. It's important days for these kinds of subjects. But today onwards for a couple of days, we're going to have the sun squaring Pluto. This is a boom. This is a volcanic eruption in the skies. It's a time that we could change status regarding those issues of Saturn and our, our creativity, the way we present ourselves in our work environment in front of other people. But we need that change to be a peaceful, a positive and, and a tranquil one and not a volcanic one. Not a, a, a death that the phoenix has to rise up from the ashes, you know? So we, we need to be very much aware not to be uh, combustible during these few days and not to lash out on other people if, and, and don't be cruel as well. There's, there's a sense of being a bit cruel with this aspect and we could either feel that people are being cruel with us or we could accidentally be cruel with other people. So watch that. Watch that and pay attention to that and minimize the drama. Venus, the planet of relationship, our satisfaction, uh, uh, our resources and love is moving into Aries today. And when Venus moves into Aries, she demands action right here, right now. I mean, uh, immediate satisfaction is, is something that is much more highlighted right now than when Venus was flowing in the Piscean waters up to now. No, this Venus knows what she wants and she wants it now. And that could be both positive and negative. On the positive side, we are uh, uh, affirming what we need to change in our lives in order to be more satisfied within our relationships regarding money, regarding our satisfaction in general. And we're going on, we're going through it, we're going for decisive action, we're moving forward. But on the negative side, if we don't watch it and if we act out of uh, you know, uh, moment uh, uh, momentary, uh, you know, crave or, or, or just, you know, a, a sudden outburst, we could hurt ourselves if we don't think about the prolonged uh, consequences of what we do and if it's healthy or positive or good for us in general. So, we're going to enjoy that for the next month. I don't know if enjoying is the right word. Probably some of it is, but we have to watch it as well. So thank you all for listening. This is all for today and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.